With general relativity, we learn that the gravitational force is best described in terms of warps and curves in space and time. And that's most directly evident at the edge of a black hole where gravity is strong and the warpage of space and time is strong. And the way we see that is, if you were to go to the edge of a black hole, but have, say, strong rocket engines so that you don't fall over the event horizon, so that you can actually, say, stay in orbit around the edge of a black hole, time for you would slow down compared to the rate of passage of time of somebody far away. So, for instance, you might stay around the edge of a black hole for a week. But when you come back, say, to Earth, you might find that 10 years have gone by because your week was in slow motion. Time is running slow compared to the rate at which time is elapsing on Earth. In fact, if it was a strong enough black hole, a big enough black hole, and if you got close enough to the event horizon to the edge, be careful, don't fall over, but stay just outside, you might spend a week at that black hole and you come back to Earth, it might be a million years or a billion years have gone by. That's the way in which black holes warp the passage of time.